Hi, welcome to the test kitchen. My name's Sherry, and today we are making rock candy, which of course the basis of that is sugar. And sugar is a type of rock that um, you can grow yourself. It's a crystal. And the way we're going to grow it here with our rock candy is make a super saturated sugar solution in a saucepan, and we're going to force the sugar crystals to bond with each other and um, make rock candy. So for the preparation of this, uh, you will have to do some um, work the night before. Follow me over here. So to prepare the skewers, you're going to want to do this the night before. You will make a little sugar solution of a quarter cup of sugar and a quarter cup of water. And I heated this in the microwave for about 30 seconds. Then you will take your skewer and you will coat the stick or skewer in the sugar solution and then roll it in uh, granulated sugar. And you will get something like this. Once it dries, I suggest tapping off some of the excess sugar so um, it doesn't fall off in your candy solution later on. So you prepared your candy stick the night before. So let's get started then with the um, making of the candy. Um, we are going to follow a procedure and we're gonna start out with one and a quarter cup of sugar and a half a cup of water and we're gonna put them in a saucepan. And right now there's no heat. So this is my one cup and this is my quarter cup. and my half a cup of water. And we want a medium low heat. And you're going to want to stir. And again, we are creating a super saturated solution, one in which there's more sugar than there is water. And when that happens, when this cools down, we're forcing the sugar crystals to kind of combine and to grow on top of each other and unite. And this will take several minutes. And we're going to stir until it is clear. And I'm turning it off the heat. We have a uh, clear solution now. And this is the time where we're going to add some flavoring. And I have a teaspoon of vanilla in my pipette. And of course, vanilla makes everything taste good. I'm going to stir that in. Oh, I splashed a little bit. And uh, now is also the time, if you would like your candy to be a color, I am going to add two or three drops of a green food coloring, but you can choose whatever color you'd like. And uh, I'm just going to stir that in until it's sort of even. And I'm going to let this cool just for a couple minutes while I prepare some jars. So I warm the jar in the microwave for about 30 seconds. So we have a warm jar. Um, and our sugar solution has cooled down just a little bit. I'm going to carefully pour this into the jar. And if you have a funnel, this might help facilitate the process here, make it a little bit safer. And one of the prepped candy skewers I've put a clothespin pin on so I can suspend that over the top of the jar about an inch from the bottom. And we're going to watch this over several days and we're going to watch as sugar crystals form on the skewer. And voila, you have a sugar a crystal uh, candy stick. 
Just kidding. This is not what yours is going to look like. This uh, was made in a factory with uniform supplies and uh, materials. Yours is going to look a little more homemade. And I've had one that's been in a jar for a couple days. And it looks a little like this. And we have one that I'm going to pull out. And we're going to see what it looks like. You will definitely want to dry this on a piece of wax paper um, overnight, just so you get a nice, dry um, rock candy that you can eat. And that is our rock candy, and we were talking about sugar. Please come to Science City and join us for other activities in the Science Center.